Okay, guys, today is Thursday, August 3rd. Uh, the world's longest yard sale today is my fifth day out. I'm um, trying to find some stuff, so I kind of talk about what I got and um, what I paid. I'm going to go from there. I got a lot of squish, and then I got a lot of video game stuff and other stuff here. So I got all this stuff here uh, today. So let's talk about what I got and what I spent. Okay, I got uh, I got all these Builder Bear, and they're like mini Builder Bear and Builder Bear buddies. I got all these for thirty. Um, there's gingerbread, ginger gingerbread, a uh, little penguin, a little bunny, a little bear me, another bear me, um, dog, triceratops. Let's see. I think there's about fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I paid a little over $2 a piece for these. It's not too bad. They'll sell anywhere from 5 to 10 each. So uh, that's a pretty good get. I got all these Squishmallows. There's, I think, 30. Um, I got all these Squishmallows for 30. Most of them have their tags. Well, maybe half of them do, I would say. You know. And I got all 30. There's a hug me. I got all 30 for 100. So... Um, that's not a bad, that's not a bad deal. That's a mush mush, isn't it? That's not a squish. That's not a squish. She threw it in there. That's okay. That's a justice. But she had, they had a, they had a marked, um, but I didn't pay. I said, well, what would you do for all of them? And she, uh, this one's going to Justin. And she, yeah, she gave me all of them for 100. So I got 30, about 30 of them here for 100, which is pretty good. So I'm going to put these in a bag and put them upstairs. And eventually these will be for sale. I got a Rick and Morty for a dollar. And there's something else in here for a buck. Uh, maybe another squish or something. Yeah, that might have been a buck. But uh, yeah, so not too bad there. All right, this was early this morning. Um, I got a bunch of stuff from this lady. Uh, who shall rename an anonymous because I don't want anybody to know. <laughs> you don't share your secrets, right? At least you shouldn't. But anyway, I got all this stuff for 300 I think I paid 300 for everything. Got an Amiibo here. Got a PlayStation um, VR set minus the VR. Uh, I got these shoes, which I can use for work. Got some bed sheets. This stuff for my wife. Final Fantasy 14. That's for my son. Or that's not for my son. Those are for my son. The Skechers. Uh, got all these hard drives. Um, got all these PS Move controllers. Got Elvis album. All this stuff in here uh, was uh, less three dollars or less each. You know, these all put on eBay. Um, I got five or six of those, so that's an easy list. If we go over here, we'll talk about those in a second. Those were, that was at another sale. These are all the video games I got. I got uh, I got this anime thing here. This is a Razer. Um, there's a bunch of Echo Dot. That was about five bucks. There's a bunch of bunch of games in here um, that I got that I paid on average maybe two dollars a piece for. Um, but maybe less than that. But you can see like there's. Some, there's some GameCube in there. There's Loose. It's Metroid Prime. There's I and I've got to value all these because I pretty much buy these for a guy who Virtual Fighter 2, Sega Saturn. I buy these for a guy who uh, Project Justice. That might be good. I'll have to look that one up. Um, I can't remember that one. I just knew that it was worth you know more than a dollar or whatever I paid on average. Um, Minecraft. But there's some really Budokai 2, Dragon Ball Budokai 2. There's some really decent ones in here. There's, uh, if I can find it, there's a couple of Budokai Tenachi 3s. Um, yeah, there they are. But, I mean, even those are pretty good games. You can see, I mean, you guys know, if you know, you know, these are $150 games. So, uh, they're not cheap. You know, there's, there's Tenachi, the Greatest Hits version. This one... I don't know if this one has a bonus disc or not. It does not, but that's okay. So, yeah, anyway, 
A uh, ton of great stuff in here. If you know anything about video games, you know that um, I absolutely killed it. I got uh, Star Wars um, LaserDisc. Uh, I'm actually, and I'm actually going, she's bringing more stuff out tomorrow. So we're going tomorrow morning to get more stuff. So we're not done. We're, we're not, we're not done. Um, oh, this is a good one. So if you guys know, this one has head coach in here, which it should. I honestly didn't even open it, but, um, it should have head coach in here and actually it's sealed. It's brand new. Never mind. I'm not even going to open it. Even better. Yep. But that one has head coach. So, I mean, that's a probably a thick 30 or $40 game. I, I, and I got it for around that $2 range. So. You know, she always takes care of me. I help her. I help her and unload the truck, and um, she takes care of me. She's a wonderful person. So, but like I said, this is all going to a video game store up in uh, Dayton, north of where I live. Super nice guy up there. He takes care of me. Um, I've got. I wrote down what I paid so far for everything. I'm at eight forty for everything. That's all this stuff. Uh, you know, and. Um, and that includes like the odd stuff, like the dollar stuff here and there, you know what I mean? So, and then, and he'll give me, I, I'm probably going to ask him for about 2,500 because there's probably six grand or so of stuff here at least. I mean, there's 500, there's, there's about three to 500 loose discs in here. Um, and they're all, you know, in that five to $10 range as far as retail. This one here is, this was a good one. These are all Amiibos. Um, this guy had, he wanted $5 a peach, which isn't a horrible deal, but there's a bunch of Amiibos in here. So, um, I got, I went up, went ahead and got them for $3 each. So these, um, once again, he's going to be buying. So that's not terrible at all. So I paid 60 for the bag. Um, yeah. So not, not bad. Pretty good. But that's pretty much it for today. Um, pretty good stuff. Like I said, this one here. Oh, I got this morning. I got I got another seventy games from a guy. I paid a hundred dollars for those. He's got some decent, you know. Uh, he's got some decent stuff. He's got some. There was some, you know, Mario Party Eight, and I think it was Wii Sports Resort and stuff like that. But definitely worth, definitely worth what I paid. So, you know, see, decent stuff in all through here. I paid about a little over a dollar a game. I mean, anytime you can buy a, a game complete for around a buck, you know, it's you can't you can't beat it. You're gonna do well. But yeah, see all those loose games down there? There's a ton of loose games. I mean, look at all those. There's there's three hundred at least three hundred and fifty loose games in there. I didn't even count, but so many. But yeah, so that's about it. But uh guys, thanks for watching and um remember <laughs> If you're starting the world's longest yard sale and you're starting the day of uh, that Thursday, you're, you're really too late. So get out there early. I know I beat it like a dead horse, but, you know, do yourself the due diligence and, and do what you need to do. You know, because ultimately the only reason I do this is to I flip this stuff and I make money for my family and I provide a better living for them. That's all I care about. Um, that's what it's about. So, uh, you know, some of you may not agree with that, but that's what I do. So, because they come first. But yeah, that's it. So thanks for watching and we'll see you. We'll see you next time.